Somber goodbyes today at the funeral for the off-duty police officer who was killed when an alleged drunk driver crashed into a Long Island nail salon. NYPD officer Amelia Renhack was among four people who lost their lives, and today family and friends paid their final respects. Fox 5's Michelle Ross reports. Hundreds of police officers line up outside New Hyde Park Funeral Home on Long Island to pay their respects to fallen NYPD officer Amelia Renhack. That infectious smile brought joy to the 102 Precinct Station House. She was just a friendly person who was liked by everyone who met her. Renhack was one of four people killed at a Deer Park nail salon last week when an accused drunk driver plowed his SUV through the storefront. She was off duty getting her nails done. The fatal crash also took the lives of three employees. 37-year-old Jian Kai Chen of Bayside, Queens, 41-year-old Yan Shu from Flushing, Queens, and 50-year-old Mei Chi Zhang also from Flushing, Queens. Police charged the 64-year-old driver Stephen Schwally with DWI. He'd been arrested for drunk driving once before in 2013. He should have never been behind the wheel of that car. And he's behind bars now and he needs to stay behind bars. New York City Mayor Eric Adams also at the funeral as Renhack's loved ones said their final goodbyes. College friends share old memories of her and say they didn't keep in touch as much as they would have liked. I feel like the priest's message is very timely. It's like, I wish, I wish that I would have reached out a little bit more, you know, in the last, I don't know, decade? Yeah, that we, we knew each other. But they'll always remember her smile and how proud she was of her Polish heritage. She always brought Polish cheesecake to the function. Her smile, her laugh, her bo she was bodacious, she was audacious, and she was unapologetic. Renhack was 30 years old and recently married to an NYPD detective also in the 102nd Precinct. As friends and family adjust to a new life without her, her legacy lives on. Reporting in New Hyde Park, Michelle Ross, Fox 5 News.